Good afternoon to all my wonderful viewers out there and welcome back to another Streetwear Talk video. The series where I cover the latest streetwear releases, I cover the latest streetwear news and of course in the series where we just discuss anything to do with streetwear or fashion. Now in today's video I'm going to be covering an upcoming collaboration. Yes, I'm going to be covering a collaboration between Palace Skateboards and Adidas as they are collaborating for a week three summer 2022 capsule. Yeah, you heard me right, guys. So for week three of Palace's summer 2022 collaboration, they decided to grab longtime partner, or I should say longtime collaborative partner, Adidas, to do some clothing for this upcoming week. Now, in today's video, we're going to be covering the release details, all the official images, and my thoughts and opinions on this collaborative nature capsule. Now, how we're going to cover all those details is, of course, by using a Hype Beast article. We'll head on over there now, and we'll just start covering the release details for this week three capsule. So here we are at the Hype Beast article, and as I said, I wasn't, you know, pointing out that it was the nature collection because I interpreted it so. That's literally what they're calling it. <laughs> the nature collaboration. And it looks like they've taken it quite literally, grabbing the colors of nature, applying it to outdoor wear or um, I guess hiking wear. We'll have to see, we have 25 images, so it looks like there's a lot to cover there, but we'll get into that just after covering the release details. So the Palace Adidas Nature Capsule will release May 20th, the Friday, just like the normal Palace releases, via the Palace web store, as well as Palace's physical store and through the Adidas confirmed app. So it'll also be releasing on Adidas's store as well. Now, it'll also release the day later on the 21st, Saturday, for Japan and the WeChat store. They've actually got this a bit mixed up. It'll be releasing in-store and online for Japan, and then it'll be releasing via the WeChat store for China. China gets it via the WeChat store. I don't know if you can buy it uh, from Japan via the WeChat store. You might be able to, but generally that's for the Chinese buyers out there. But uh, yeah. Let's have a look. As the article says, take a closer look at everything dropping above. Let's go ahead. <laughs> so we have 25 images to cover. Let's see what pieces we're going to be getting in this Palace Adidas Nature capsule for week three. Okay, so here is the first piece, this jacket. <laughs> it's, I mean, the colors are nice. The orange and blue down the arms don't actually put me off. I like that it's matching the detailing on it. We've got, you know, blue and orange little uh, zips and everything like that and co-branding. Normally these crazy colors like this would turn me off, but using this brown color palette has actually worked out quite well. I don't mind this piece too much. It opens up to a mesh interior, keeping it nice and lightweight. Easy to rock in summer, works well for Palace's summer season. We've got nature embroidered in this colorful color spectrum and then a little plant at the end there with a palace and the adidas logo there as well it actually works quite well the branding works quite well the nature part it's nice next we move into a fleece crew neck with the colors down the sides of the arms here co-branding nice little pocket pockets down the sides here as well which is a bit strange for a crew neck it's um yeah it's an interesting piece i i like the color scheme i like the material choice i like the little bits of branding and you know motifs and stuff all over it i was actually coming in here thinking it was going to be really bad but it's not that bad i like the embroidered branding on the back got some co-branded tees i actually could have, would have liked it if it was a bit more low-key and they just had the branding on the front and nothing on the back but they obviously go got to go a little bit crazy here we've got the blue Nice colors, green, same, same. Orange, little bit too bright for me. I don't really want to look like an orange, so I think I'd avoid that one. We've got the matching pants to the jacket. It works quite well, but you could also wear it by itself. There we go there, that's it tightened at the bottom, so you can tighten it if it's a little bit too baggy for you. We've got a showcasing on the back there. There's the butt pocket and some more motifs there. It almost looks like there's, like you can unzip it there, but I don't think you can. I think it's just the material choice where they've cut it off there. Got a side shot of it there. We got some shorts to match the, crew, the fleece crew neck, some fleecy shorts. 
Not too bad either. We've got a cap, but I think it's still a little too much. I think it is detachable looking at the buttons here, so you might be able to get rid of this very extended uh, sun protection here. Because <laughs> I wouldn't want to wear it like that. I think just the normal cap would be all right. Uh, so you see what I mean? It's got like little buttons there. Hopefully you can detach it because... Oh, actually, no, it doesn't look very detachable, does it? Uh, I would have liked it to be detachable because it's just, I don't know, it's a bit too much. And the pa and the Adidas logo down the back of it? Yeah. Nah. <laughs> the jacket and pants, that's okay. The hat, a little bit too much. We've got a backpack as well. There we go. And I think that's it. Yeah, okay. So we're getting a couple graphic tees. We're getting a fleece crew neck kind of combined with a jacket uh, and some fleece shorts as well. And then we're getting a nylon polyester jacket with some matching cargo pants as well. Uh, all in all, it's actually better than I thought. Whenever I hear Palace and Adidas, I get worried because I'm like, oh geez, here we go. But this is actually kind of cool. I don't mind this. I wouldn't personally pick up any of it because I'm not into that type of aesthetic. Like something like this I wouldn't wear, but I can respect it. I'm like, yeah, okay, that's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Uh, <laughs> I mean, yeah, as I said, when I hear Palace Adidas, I get worried, but not the worst. Um, but yeah, if they kept the branding, the only comments that I can really say about it that where I'm like nitpicking, they could have kept the branding maybe just a little bit more low key, like the the nylon very loud colors for the branding on the shoulders and arms is taken away from it a bit it would have been nicer just to have like a bit of co-branding here and on the back they do always go a little bit too crazy on it but apart from that if you're a huge palace fan huge adidas fan this is going to be the perfect collab for you for me i'm going to skip out on it because i'm not hugely sold on it but yeah it's not too bad not too bad um i want to hear from you guys how do you feel about this Palace Adidas collaboration for week three? Are there any pieces that really stand out for you? I think it's okay. It's uh, not amazing. It's not horrible. Maybe it's like a six out of 10, six and a half out of 10. <laughs> you know, like it's all right, it's okay. Uh, I think it works best when you all wear it together, but maybe you feel differently about that. Seriously, let me know anything you have to say about the collab down in that comment section below. Well, we covered everything to do with this collaboration, guys. We're getting a backpack, a hat, a pair of cargos, a matching jacket, a fleece uh, crew neck jacket thingy, uh, fleece shorts, a bunch of tees. That is it. That is the Palace Adidas Nature Collab. Releasing this Friday, the 20th or the 21st, if you live in Japan and China. We'd love to hear if you're going for any for it. Are you going to be picking any of this collab up? I'm... I'm okay with not picking any of it up. I'm not a huge fan of like overly branded Adidas or Nike stuff. So stuff like this, it's cool. Uh, as the as I said before, if they kept the branding a little bit more low key, maybe I could have gotten around it a little bit more, but it is a little bit too loud with too much, you know, logos and stuff going on. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna leave it, but maybe you're a big fan of this. Maybe you're like, hey, Adidas doesn't do a lot of a lot of this, like, you know, outdoor uh, condition gear kind of stuff. So seeing this is awesome. Maybe you're really feeling it. If you're picking anything up from it, I'd love to hear what you're going for this Friday down in that comment section below. And of course, if you guys want to keep covering upcoming Palace releases, upcoming Adidas releases, you got to give me the three indicators I'm always asking you for, which is a like on this video, a comment in that comment section down below, and the best indicator of them all that you can give me is of course, a subscribe to the channel. Now, uh, we're trying to aim for a new subscriber milestone as well this month of 3,335 subscribers. We are so close. For hitting that subscriber milestone <laughs> hopefully with your guys continuous support we can reach that milestone before the end of the month but that's everything i gotta say about this uh palace and adidas collaboration this nature collab they use a lot of nature colors browns and greens <laughs> they add a bit of blue Oof. water as well <laughs> uh yeah it's 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 all right it's not gonna be something we're gonna be referring to many years down the line we're not gonna be like yo do you remember the nature palace adidas collab but it's okay if you if you're into it you're into it it'll be your type of thing but 
I'm not too drawn to it, but that's everything I really got to say about it. We've covered everything to do with it. It's releasing this Friday slash Saturday. I hope you managed to pick it up if you are going for it. But until the next Palace video, until the next Adidas video, until the next Streetwear Talk video in general, guys, I'll catch you later.